What's going on guys? This is Chris from Editor Tricks and today I'm going to show you how to add a scroll to top button to your Weebly site. Now this video tutorial will follow uh, the written step-by-step -step tutorial that can be found on Editor Tricks and I will post a link to that written step-by-step -step tutorial uh, in the description of this video. Okay, so let's get started. All right, so the first thing we need to do here is we need to add the animate.css HTML tag to our Weebly site. So copy this HTML tag here. Now go to settings at the top. On the left, click on SEO. And on the right, under header code, paste in the HTML tag that you copied. And then just click save on the bottom right. Step two, we need to open Weebly's HTML CSS editor. To do that, go to theme at the top and on the bottom left, click on edit HTML forward slash CSS. Okay. Step three, add HTML codes. So copy the HTML code provided in the written tutorial. And now on the left under header type, select uh, the first page layout. And on the right, directly underneath the body tag, Give yourself some space. Paste in the HTML code that you copied from the written tutorial. Now repeat this step for every other page layout that your, that your theme has. Step four, let's add some CSS code. So copy all of the CSS codes in the written tutorial here. And on the left under styles, click on main.less. And on the right, scroll all the way to the bottom, beyond the last code that is in the file. You're going to paste in the CSS code that you copied from the written tutorial. If you see any of these little red dots, you can just make sure that uh, you delete them. You don't want them in there. So we have three in there. All right, we're looking good. Whoops. Sorry about that. I accidentally closed the tab there. All right, where are we at? Step five, add jQuery codes. All right, so copy the jQuery codes from the written tutorial. Now on the left under assets, click on custom.js. And on the top, directly beneath the first line of jQuery coding, give yourself some space and paste in those jQuery codes that you copied from the written tutorial. Okay. And I'm as again, again, get rid of any of these red dots you see here. I'm going to actually clean this up a bit. The format didn't translate. Uh, here we go. That's better. Okay. Step six. Let's add our dash icons. So download all four of the dash icon font files here provided in the written tutorial. Okay, I want you to do that. Um, under assets, click the little plus icon, select new folder, and then you're going to name this new folder fonts. When TS, click on the outside of it so it so, um, so it makes it official. And then uh, to the right, I click on the little gear icon, select upload files, and you're going to upload all four of those dash icon font files that you downloaded. Okay, so all four are uploaded here. Now on the right, top right, click on save. I'll let that, give that a second to load. Looks like it's loaded. Click publish. And let's see if our scroll to top icon appears in the bottom right corner of the screen. All right, so keep your eye here on the bottom right as I scroll. And there it is. Let's give it a shot, let's give it a test. So click it, go to the top, scroll down goes up. Looks like it works. All right, guys. So um, I hope you found this tutorial to be useful. Um, and I will see you in the next video.